Hey everybody, it's February 13th, 2000, February 13th, 2013, say that 10 times fast. It's nice to come home after teaching a class with the moms and finding your dog threw up on your uh, girlfriend's comforter and outside, then outside. So, it just got clean the other day because Peanut got sick like a week ago, or less than a couple days ago, so. She's out of it, she's laying on the couch, I'm gonna let her be. Been up since uh, 3.30, couldn't fall back asleep. That's why I look a little crazy. I gotta go teach a kids class today, which is gonna suck like nobody's business, but it is what it is. Um, and tomorrow's Valentine's Day, which has never been a good holiday for me. I think I've had, um, you can count on one hand how many times it's been an actually good occasion. But uh, yogurt does not like flowers or candy, and she actually doesn't like the holiday at all. So I don't know what we're gonna do. So. Uh, but she wants to do something fun this weekend, so I got to think of something fun to do. So that's what that's what I have to do. Something fun. Maybe we'll go uh, walk over hot coals or something. Or uh, she's already done Target. I've always wanted to go to a shooting range. She's already done that, so I can't. She said one year they did they they had their bucket list and they did everything on their bucket list. And it made me think about my bucket list. Uh, I want to jump out of an airplane. Wanted a bulldog. I want this Porsche. And uh, I always wanted to go to a Dallas Cowboy football game. But the list was, oh, and go to China and Japan. But really, the list was never that long. I mean, I think I wrote out a ton of stuff, but I threw that notebook away. So I wrote out 100 things, I think, at the time. I wonder if I look back, if any of those things will matter to me anymore. I don't know. So, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm a little distracted with Peanut and wondering how she's feeling. She doesn't look too good. And I'm thinking about what I fed her. I mean, I've only been giving her dog food, but she's still been getting sick. So, I don't know what's going on with her. She doesn't look good. I can tell when my dog doesn't look good. She doesn't look good right now. So, I'm not feeling too good about that. Uh, nothing to really report on the acting front because it's been really slow. I'd sent stuff out to an agent. My friend actually referred me to somebody, and uh, she's too busy right now to uh, look at my materials. Well, I guess that's a nice way of saying that uh, I'm just too busy in general. So, say la vie, vie la say. So, I sent out the two agents, and I haven't heard, didn't hear from either of them. And uh, my mom said she met somebody who knew some of agent, so uh, they were going to try to contact that person. But uh, I'm not holding my breath on that front either. So, all I do is send out stuff every day, like I always do, like a, and see what happens. So, um, what else is going on? Uh, yeah, I tried watching some of the president last night. I know they're all going crazy about Rubio with the water. He was thirsty. I don't believe any of these politicians. I felt like I was listening to Obama last night talk like he was running for, re running for the re-election. It just sounded like a lot of stuff in the way they were clapping. It just sounded like uh, like a TV with uh, canned laughter. That's what it sounded like. That's what it felt like to me. It just felt really fake. And he said all this stuff, and it went in one ear and went out the other to me, in my opinion, because I don't know. I'm curious of how many things that when a guy comes in office they actually do. I think politicians are standard philosophers. They're bullshit artists. That was my favorite thing in uh, that and uh, it's good to be the king. That was in um, history of the world. But the, it's good to be the king and uh, oh, I'm a standard philosopher. Oh, a bullshit artist. And that's what I would call them, a bullshit artist. So uh, yeah, I'm upset about peanut. I taught a kids class yesterday. The kids, compared to my kids, were like angels. So today I got to deal with the uh, psychotic kids. Um, Yogurt wants to get a pinata for her friend's birthday tomorrow. Her birthday is on Valentine's Day. That's a shitty day to have a birthday. So she's all depressed. She's single, whatever. So uh, Yogurt said she's getting her a Valentine's pinata, which is all the way up in my hood on like 160th Street. So I think uh, I said I'd go get it for her, and she said no. So right now I'm just tired, and I got to two hours I gotta leave the house again to go out to deal with these kids so uh <laughs> yeah Jane Fonda I don't know is this deep enough for you is this intensity enough for you I don't know anymore I'm just being me I'm just dealing with situations that happen right this second and right this second I'm dealing with my dog who threw up and I'm never she's gonna puke again and that's why having pets is a pain in the motherfucking ass because they can't talk to you and they can't tell you what's wrong with them because I wish you'd be like Daddy, I can't eat that stuff. We gave her some peanut butter. Maybe the peanut butter bothered her stomach. Maybe she ate a carrot. I don't know what the hell. This dog just, you know, I don't know. 
All right. I hope everybody has a great day. I will talk to you soon. All right. Peace out.